Hello. All right, take a hint. Don't do acrobatics in your chair. All right. Week five uh, was kind of like a little bit of a hard week. Um, but you have those two. Uh, Monday, I did work out lower body and I also feel like I did pretty well on food this day. Tuesday, I did not feel like eating. Uh, I still like have that from the last week there where I kind of I'm struggling with getting food in because like I'm sad and I, I realize that I when I feel like I'm losing control and this is like I know this is not the best of behaviors and this is kind of something that is like, it's just like in the back of my head. I, I can't even, I don't feel like I can control it, even though I'm trying, of course. Uh, but it feels like controlling food when I feel like there's other parts of my life where I don't have control. It's like an easy coping mechanism, which it isn't. It's not healthy, but I don't know maybe so I try to be conscious about that so I don't fall into and kind of like eating disorder kind of mindset which is not good at all uh, so these are just like things that I try to be conscious of so that I make sure that I stay healthy and that my body is healthy and it kind of like it kind of carries on to the rest of my life the people that I love um, and I managed to be there for them also. So it's, it's like, it has a lot of good benefits to try to be just conscious about these things. I also did stream Diablo 4 was, uh, launched for us common folks this day and, uh, it was a great time streaming it. So yes, <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, it's such a fun game. You should try it if you haven't. Wednesday, I had some breakfast. Later on the day, I also went on a hike with my mom and I went to the gym. Thursday, I... Not sure if I did say it in that last video, but I ended up accepting that job offer that I got. And uh, with me having a lot of vacation days saved up and a lot of plus time, I had my last day of work on Thursday so <laughs> everything happened a little bit too like too fast for my liking I like things to just like slowly just transition but no right away so now I'm here with like two and a half months of paid time off and I will have all the time in the world to meal prep eat and work out and just enjoy myself so um yeah <laughs> uh, anyways had the last day of work and it was really nice uh like saying goodbye to my co-workers i got a beautiful bouquet of roses and uh, we had uh, like a goodbye gathering where there was cake i did have a piece of cake i am not ashamed to admit it i 
thought to myself I'm gonna enjoy this like small piece of cake and have a cup of coffee and enjoy it and it was really nice and then I was making sure that I met my proteins and I had met my carbohydrates in that piece of cake so I tried to like minimize carbs in like the day and the days after just kind of to make sure that I didn't do any big damage one small piece of cake will not make any big damage when you are in the area where I am at right now but it should also just be that one piece of cake it shouldn't be like 10 of them you know <laughs> there's a difference I also went to the gym uh, later on that day that was oh my god that was hard but I also knew that I probably wouldn't be able to go to the gym on Friday because I was streaming and I had some other stuff that I needed to do so I figured out that I might as well just do it. it it was okay once I got there but like getting out of the door oh my god it was so hard but that's how it is sometimes you just have to take control and just do it Friday was not like super duper noteworthy I had some errands that I did uh, on the daytime and then I streamed on the evening not much to say about Friday Saturday however I did have a check-in with my coach I did new measurements I did not film it because I was like in a little bit of a hurry so I just had to like get it done and then go run some errands uh, but uh, we're gonna go through them now I'll just go get my phone okay fantastic thing about having an app with uh, with the whole coach thingy so new measurements and I lost quite some centimeters between like two weeks ago and this one I think it also was because I was a little bit bloated and I think I held a little bit water when I did my last check-in because I was on my period and stuff which of course affects your form so new weight was 64.3 kilos down one kilo oh damn shush thank you uh, waist was 66.5 centimeters which is down four and a half centimeters which is just mind-boggling I think it's a lot of water weight there but I'm not quite sure it can't, it, that can't be, all be fat it's just too much uh, stomach 74.5 centimeters down also there 4.5 centimeters which is just crazy my thigh was 52 centimeters down one centimeter my butt was a 99.5 centimeters down three and a half centimeters and then my bicep was at 31 centimeters which is up half a centimeter which we love hello they're growing the buns no that's not that's not what you call buns is it these are the guns and the butt is the buns i think i think so working out in the evening and then sunday i had a good breakfast i had almost 100 grams of protein in that breakfast i don't think it is like super duper good to have that much in one meal i think i heard or read something somewhere and i might be wrong of course that your body can only take a certain amount of protein each meal so you're better off with like portioning it throughout the day than having it all in one meal I might be wrong but um, it's food for thought anyways uh, we did a hike six kilometers hike it was really nice it was fantastic weather on Sunday and uh, then gym after so it was a good day had some pizza actually after the workout which was fantastic we've been talking about it for a couple of days 
uh, and uh, yeah decided to do it on Sunday do not regret it and um, it was a very very nice piece of pizza will recommend <laughs> All right, what I'm taking from this week is that it, this was better. This week was easier than the last, of course. But what I'm taking from it is these weeks do also happen. And this was not a bad week by any means. Uh, I feel like I ate well. I got to the gym. I did my exercises. Sometimes it will be harder getting kind of out of the couch or out of the house and get to the gym to do what has to be done but I think it is very smart to try at least to remember why you're doing it and uh, for me that helps and also just being real with myself not lying to myself not making any excuses if you don't want to it's fine you don't want to then you can kind of like think about okay if I don't want to today will I want to tomorrow did I do it yesterday what's best for me kind of take out of the equation what you want to do but what's best for me and how much control do I have to take right now which can be hard sometimes it's, it's easier said than done <laughs> we all know that uh, that's gonna be it for this week thank you for watching um, yes thank you for watching take care of yourself take care of the ones you love and I'll see you in the next one bye